This guy has turned into quite the camera hog. <laughs> what are you doing? No. And a very abusive one at that. No, don't bite me. This is his new thing now. I think he's getting his eye teeth in. And I'm telling you guys, it's not so fun. <laughs> we have almost stopped breastfeeding. No. Because he will intentionally bite me. Guys, if you haven't experienced this, ah, uh, oh my goodness. Anyway, we are very excited because tomorrow, Steve and I get to go to our very first RV show. We're going to the Toronto RV show and it's been happening since I think Thursday of this week and it's now Saturday. So we're going to go tomorrow, Steve's day off. And we're going to go early. We're going to head there and check out as many of the RVs as we could possibly handle in our brains. <laughs> and we're going to vlog as much as we can. And we're going to share our favorites uh, with all of you. And if you guys have some specific models or suggestions or things like that that you want to pass on, please do. Um, if you have any questions about things that we're thinking about or considering when it comes to full-time RV life, then let us know and we'll do our best to answer them. Where are you going right now? To Nanny's. To Nanny's? Yuppers. Yuppers. All by yourself? Yep. All by myself. Oh, wow. Well, you were going to come with us, but you're going to stay home with Grandma today? Grandma and Jackson? Hi! Yes, buddy. What you doing? You got a little runny nose there, bud. You watching your shows? Yes, You gonna have fun with Grandma and Logan? Yeah. Sweet. Handsome man. <laughs> Self-deprecating handsome man, but... <laughs> with my sister. So his sister is coming along, so she'll probably be either in the vlogs or she'll be the one filming us. But uh, we get a, a daytime date today, and a kind of a whole day date, which is fun. But we will have a third wheel. <laughs> That's not a one of our children. I'm excited to see some Arby's, so I really don't care who's here. I just need to see some Arby's. <laughs> Yeah, we came in here and stopped. <laughs> this is Michelle. <laughs> She's my sister-in-law. We're gonna have fun. Well, as much fun as yeah, as much fun as two girls can have in an RV show. Okay. So this is one of our favorites so far. This is a fifth wheel. Looks like it has some nice storage. Looks like a double sink, actually. Let me just see here. Yep, double sink. Bunk beds for the kids, which is great. They're double bunk beds, it looks like. This is 
a Flagstaff super light. This is our first Airstream that we're ever going in. I know, it's really cool, huh? I've heard amazing things about the Airstreams. party deck of this really amazing fifth wheeler. TSB is that the third oh, um, TSB um, and yeah. it's got a massive room back here like it's huge look at this room and the bunks on the left are double bunks both of them you've got tons of storage space there almost like an area for a media center we could maybe put a little TV to have the kids watch their shows whenever we want to kind of have some adult time <laughs> Um, it's not how it sounds, but anyway, there's some nice storage closet space. Like once we pare down all the things that we need to pare down, that's really going to be a lot. And then this folds up if we wanted to, and that is a bed right now, but it can also be a couch. Now this is a huge selling point for me. This island, I love this island. That can fold down to another bed if we need it. I'm, I'm going to hazard a guess to say this could fold into a bed if we really needed it to, but I don't know that for sure. That's Huge shower. Hi! 
This is exciting. Nice shower walls too. It actually looks like it's, and I love the star ceiling or the skylight. So well, uh, the thing with the fifth wheel is that we have to get a pickup, right? So that means all three kids have to sit yeah. in the back of the pickup. It has to be a full cab pickup. Obviously. Because yeah, yeah, obviously, but that's still the, the Okay, cheat. Okay, hey, yeah. so that was our first RV trip, and we obviously had a few things that we really loved, um, and things that were really just fun to see, like the Airstream Hi. Tommy Bahama. Hello. Hi, my nice crown. So the Tommy Bahama was really fun to see in person. Actually, I've been curious about it. Um, so that was, you know, obviously not something we were going <laughs> to buy or anything. But it was really cool to see the differences between travel trailers and fifth wheels. So um, I think Steve and I have kind of come to the conclusion that fifth wheels technically have more of what we're looking for in terms of layout and feeling for long-term traveling. The problem is we're trying to figure out whether it's doable to come up with a plan to have, because we're essentially going to need two vehicles. We do want to make plans to grow our family, which is a different vlog. But um, before that, if we're thinking long-term, you know, we want to be able to have two vehicles to be able to fit the kids even just the three kids right now, you know, we could get a truck and just have the three in the back, but then we wouldn't have any more room in case life happened. <laughs> so we would love for life to be able to happen, if you know what I mean, and not have to worry about space or whatever. So we kind of want to plan for it if we can. What we were looking for at the RV show mostly was 
um, ideas for long term, like when we go on the road full time, which is a, probably a few years away, to be honest. Um, we've done a lot of talking about it and we really can't wait to get on the road full time, but the full time stuff is probably going to happen in a few years from now as opposed to ASAP. So there's quite a few things we really do. We're planners that way. We do want to set ourselves up so that we don't have to, um, hopefully worry too much about, um, income and things like that. So hopefully it'll be sooner, but anyway. So I hope you guys enjoyed some of the layouts that we showed you. We kind of skipped through a few just to give you a bit of an idea because once you look at one, sometimes it feels like you're looking at a million because they all kind of start to meld together and look the same. But the next RV show that we go to is in Mississauga. This one was in Toronto. Um, and so the next one is in Mississauga and we got a lot more opportunity to just relax through that one. And we focus on the next one on A and C classes. So we took some videos of those layouts. So that one's coming up very soon as well. Um, we have a few other vlogs to get up before then, but you'll see in an upcoming vlog, the next RV show that we go to. And we're also gonna do a short uh, video on our RV plans currently, because we have been, you know, like I said, thinking about doing this at least part-time and figuring out what we want to do, when we want to do it. So we'll go through that in a future vlog. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. We love our subscribers. Welcome to all of our new subscribers. And uh, the next video is actually going to be a little bit of a, uh, an explanation on homeschooling. So I'm going to go through some of that. And then, yeah, we have a few others to throw up there too. So we'll see you next time. Bye.